when you're ready, guys. What are you doing? I'm reading the paper! Because <laughs> on that pump, we just had a massive breakfast. Thank you, family. Thank you so much. We've just finished the first day of Brekkie for June Appeal 2018. And you guys came to the party, did they Yeah, not? we're over at 22 grand already and we're on our way to 492,000. We can't do it. We can't celebrate the next 30 years of hope if we're not going to be here. So we need you to get onto the phone. Yeah, so if you're listening right now, 9313-0985 or 98five.com. Can I read my paper? Then? Yes, you can read your paper. What a crazy start to the day. We started with the pineapple challenge, which went nuts. So $50 donations were matched by some fantastic families. Uh, we had the prawn challenge. We've had uh, North of the River challenge twice. And all the North of the River people got to give. And thanks to those people that gave today, it was amazing. But thanks to the families and the businesses that have already got online and they want to match your donation. So look out for those matching uh, donation events that are coming up. Well, we're nearly at the end of day one for our June Appeal 2018. It's been a great day. Uh, I think the highlight for me for today, it's so encouraging seeing so many great messages coming through saying, keep up the great work, we love what you do. So we find that really encouraging, so thank you. I think the best thing about the June Appeal and the first day is the way that the people rang up and got behind the radio station, which is 98.5, and uh, the way they just donated. It's great to hear people ringing up and saying what a difference 98.5 makes in their life. Hey family, Mel and Gazeel here, and we're in June Appeal 2018, and wow, what a day it was today. Jess's story was so incredible. Yeah, we had a listener call up Jess. He had a super rough day today um, and she called up and she donated, but not only did she share her funds with us, uh, but she shared her heart and she's going through a difficult time, but she genuinely is uh, touched by 98.5 and like, this is why we do this and we can't do it without you family and we just want to yeah, say a big thank you that it is people like Jess that we um, yeah, can continue to do what we do and uh, yeah, just can't thank you enough. Honestly, mm. hearing that story, me and Mal were both sitting here trying not to cry on air because that's the reason both of us are here. Mm. Forget the funds, forget the job. We, yeah. anyone, we can get a job anywhere. We're here to touch people uh, the best way we know mm. how, and that's just talking into people's lives. Yeah. And hearing that story from Jess, that just broke both of our yeah. hearts. So let's continue to keep doing that, and you can do that by supporting us, family. You can just head online, 98fibu.com.